All right, hi folks, Mickey Brown here, Southeastern Marine. We're on the bow of a vessel that's currently underway, and I'm really excited about this one. This is a special rig for some special customers. We really like these people. We love this boat. I, I think of all the Sea Hunt boats that we've sold, or of all the models that we sell, I think this is my favorite boat that they make. And we're on board the 27 Game Fish 2021 model, and I'm up here on the bow of a boat that's underway, under autopilot, that was not ordered with autopilot, but we dealer installed an autopilot here in Southeastern Marine. We also installed, we broke our cherry on this one, our first Rodan 84 inch, 36 volt trolling motor up here on the bow. Custom install, did a really good job. It came out really clean. I like putting the plug down here as opposed to in the anchor locker because there's a lot of water coming in that anchor locker. and. Frankly, that's a much drier location. So I think we did good there. We've got a radar on board this boat. We've got a nice big old redneck light bar from Lumatech, the new Razor. Got the radar up on an arch. Got our Yamaha autopilot controller up there on the top. I'm gonna come down here. We've got the bow filler up here on board. These tan premium Oasis vinyl cushions. Plenty of seating up here. Plenty of room up here. Also plenty of fishability up here. I'm standing on the bow filler. It's as solid as can be. I can jump up and down. We can have a good time. I want to show you inside. Uh, show us, uh, show our install in here in the cabin or in the in the middle of the console. We got the blue lights going. We got all three trolling motor batteries over there. We got the black box for the uh, autopilot. This one, of course, came with the side entry ladder. Plenty of room still to use the toilet, vacuum flush toilet system, but. I think the coolest part is what we got going on here at the helm. So, what I want to show you, and I previewed this a few days back, was the Yamaha Autopilot system new for 2021 on board this brand new Sea Hunt 27 Game Fish. And all the while we've been filming, we've had it actually on heading hold, heading against the current upriver. So we pointed it in a direction, told it to go, and it's been going. And so now, I can simply take over the wheel, and I'm completely in control right now. Digital electric steering. And I didn't even show you on the back. Pearl white custom painted twin 250 XCAs with digital steering. This boat's also got our removable bench seat back here. As well as the mezzanine seat I think is the best seat in the house with live wells underneath both sides. Matter of fact, we are full of James River. That is a full James River live well up in here. But what I want to show you is I want to show you the electronic system on this boat. And in particular, we've got two new cool things going as if the Rodan wasn't enough. We did the Yamaha autopilot. We've got the radar system. So over here, you can actually see we're doing radar overlay as we're underway. We're actually overlaying the radar on top of the chart plotter. You can actually see the land. You can see the fixed objects. You can see the buoys over there or the poles over there with the flags flying. And then over here on my left, on the port side screen, we've actually got uh, Garmin's new live scope imaging system. So this gives you images in real time. It's a better, more accurate depth finder when you're fixed over something stationary, watching what's going on underneath of you. But what I can simply do is scroll up and around the corner with this autopilot, push the auto guidance button. I'm not going to save my last path because this one's headed to Reedville. What's up, Bubba? <laughs> but we're going to start navigating and nothing happened. But if I simply push this track point button, we are now a self-driving boat. All I have to do is sit here and work the throttles. And because it's over 26 foot, I don't have to wear my kill lanyard, even though I should. Always recommend it. Wear your flotation devices. Anyway, we're going to get underway. With twin 250s, this boat has no problem getting up the plane, getting to speed. We're going to go real easy, brand new boat. And we're just going to simply watch, sit back and observe, make sure we don't see any obstructions or any issues. And we're just going to let the boat drive on its own. The radar's looking for any issues. We're looking for any issues. 
As you can see, our visibility is not impaired at all by the road end trolling motor once we actually get the nose up and over on plane. So, hands free. I feel like I'm being arrested. You're good. But a hands free driving boat driving itself straight to the destination. So here we are making a turn. I promise we're not making the turn, it's making it for us. And there we go, we're up on, up on our side, banking over to our destination. We're heading back to Osborne Landing. They got a new owner. They redid the whole place. It's a destination now. We got a restaurant. We got bands. <laughs> all right, folks, hang in here because we're about to see the neatest feature of all. Once we reach our destination, which is here in a mere matter of seconds, this boat is going to decelerate on its own. That's right. I did not touch. I did not touch the throttle, I did not touch the steering wheel, and just like that, we have reached our destination on board a self-driving Yamaha Autopilot, Garmin integrated, live scope imaging, Phantom radar. We didn't even talk about the Rodan trolling motor, we just showed off the fact we had it. We didn't even play with that, but that's what happens when you've got a completely integrated system from Garmin Electronics, from Yamaha Outboards, from Sea Hunt Boats, and from Southeastern Marine all co-mingled, meshed together into one superfluous boat control system. So as always, I want to thank you for taking a quick look, quick video walkthrough, quick little sea trial. Take one more pan out at this custom rig. I love the mezzanine seat. You dropped your sunglasses. It's also nice, guys, to have a good cameraman that can also work on these boats. I want to thank Kenny Updike for, for, for videoing for me today. We got custom painted motors on this boat. We gotta put the decals on it. This one's headed to Reedville Saturday. No days off, sky is the limit. As always, thanks for watching. Give us a call at 804-226-1111, southeastmarine.net. As always, give us a try before you buy. This is Mickey Brown, Kenny Updike. Rigged this whole boat, and he's on my camera now. Thanks for watching. Mickey Brown, out.